There are literally YouTubers that can build their cars from the ground up in two weeks or less. But if you're anything like me, you don't have that much time or that much money. So in today's video, I'm gonna be installing $200 worth of mods in under two hours. Let's see if we could do it. So let's set up some ground rules for this video. I have two hours to install everything. I'm not gonna time setting up the camera, but I am gonna time the installation. Also, everything you see in this video is gonna be linked below. This is everything that we're gonna be installing in today's video. We have a Cusco extended gas pedal, LED lights, taillight overlays from Kevin Vo, some hood struts, and finally, some carbon fiber side blades. So none of this is very hard to install, but it's still definitely gonna be a challenge to get everything installed in under two hours. I'm gonna be giving away a pair of these fender blades, side blades, fender garnishes, whatever you call them. I'm gonna be giving away a pair of these for your GR86 or BRZ. Stay tuned and find out how you can enter later in the video. By now you're probably like, shut the fuck up and get started with the video. So let's go ahead and get it started. One thing I don't like about this car is that it has this, a floppy hood. And trust me, no man wants a floppy hood. In order to fix our floppy hood problem, we have this, a 2022 and up GR86-BRZ hood strut. I would just like to thank this company for giving us two um, pictures for the installation. I clicked on the URL actually and it leads to a generic installation video. So it's gonna take some figuring out. So yeah, I'm not trying to put pressure on the hood, so I'm using my hand. But that does not look like it's gonna close. After a bit of digging, it's totally my fault. So this is why I got confused. Let me show you guys. I saw IR right there, and then I saw it right there as well. So I was like, cool, IR. But then I was like, where the heck is this weird looking piece coming from? It's not there. And all I literally had to do was look a little bit deeper and it says, I don't know if you guys can see that, but it does say IR right in front of the bolt and there's that weird looking piece. <laughs> Gotta go a little bit slower to go faster, you know, pay attention to the small details. So let's go ahead and install this correctly. Come on, hand, whoo. Gonna put these on. Okay, clips are on. The right side of the car took me almost 49 minutes to figure out. So let's hope that this side is a lot faster. All right, take a look at that. No more hood support. Whatever you call that thing. Let's see. Amazing. So, oh, hold on. Let's check the alignment real quick. Let's see what it looks like. All right, this side looks good. This side looks good. So that's a successful install, but we've gone through half of the time we're supposed to do this. So let's move on to the install number two. Next, we have the Cusco gas pedal extender. So what this is supposed to do is make heel towing way easier. When I'm braking and trying to heel tow, I mean, I can kind of do it. I feel like I don't have enough pressure on the brake pedal comfortably. So that way, when I'm pressing the brake, trying to blip the throttle, my foot slips off sometimes. So this is gonna make it a lot easier than where I could just go like this. So let's go ahead and throw it on. First things first, let's clean it with some degreaser. Stick it on there lightly. Make small adjustments. Press on just like so. So all I did was basically pre-assemble all the nuts and bolts. It should just slip on just like so. Let's move it as far as possible. All right, now time to tighten everything. This is it's gonna be tough. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that off camera. So here's what it looks like installed and it makes a world of difference just trying to heel toe. I don't really heel toe like this and it makes a big difference because the ball of my foot is actually resting comfortably enough on the brake pedal. So that way when I'm going to a corner, I could just boom, 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 boom. So now that we have the Cusco gas pedal extender installed, 
It only took us about 10 minutes to do it. Next thing we're gonna install some LEDs because the ones in here are yellow and honestly, they're not that good. And this is gonna make a big difference, you know, when you turn this on or open the trunk. So let's go ahead and take these out. Okay, this one should be good. There we go. Like so. And look at that. Nice and bright, ugly and yellow. Boop. And time to do the trunk lights. There we go. Let's pop this new boy in here. In with the new. There we go. So the interior is all done with the gas pedal and the light and now it's an hour and 19, about to be an hour and 20 and we still have two more installs to do. So now we're gonna tackle the tail light overlays from Kevin Vo. And this is the tail light overlay. We have a right and a left and then a right and left. Make sure we have a nice and clean surface. Now the cool thing about this is you can get two different options. You can get a light smoke or you can get a dark smoke. I obviously went with the dark smoke. I think since this is black, I think it'll make it look a lot better. Okay, pretend like I've done this before. And oh my goodness, dude, this literally changes the whole look of the rear. Just this side compared to that side, look at that. Oh my goodness, that looks tons, tons better. So we gotta do the other corner piece right here. Let's see. Woo! All right, time to do the other side. And with a little bit of magic, the left side is done. Time for the last install. So this is a carbon fiber fender garnish. Let's get out of the way. This is actually plastic, but dude, look at this. It looks pretty darn good. But I said earlier in my video, you can win this for your GR86 or BRZ. So how do you enter? Go to my Instagram, go to the reel that looks like this. And all you have to do is like, comment and tag three friends. And the more you comment and tag three friends, the higher your chances of winning are. And after one week it's been up, I'm just gonna drop it on a, a website to pick a random winner. So hopefully in two weeks time of filming this, someone will win this for their BRZ or 8.6. So on the left, we have my carbon spoiler. And on the right, we have this plastic piece. And honestly, to a person just passing by or looking at the car, you wouldn't be even, you know, be able to tell. So let's go ahead and throw this on the car. First thing we have to do is clean this right here. You don't want any dust. So the reason why I went with plastic is because I actually wanted uh, this carbon fiber one, but as of right now, they're not available. And it replaces this whole entire piece right here, which looks so sick. Let's lightly put this into place. All right, sitting naturally matches up with the body lines. Okay, I think we could start pressing now. There we go. Dude, that should be, oh my gosh. Look at that. Look at that, dang man. For the left side, left side is done. And oh my goodness, look at the time, an hour and 50. I can't believe we did this, all those installs in under two hours, which is insane. You could literally do this before your next car meet. And if you have a friend with you, you could probably do it in under an hour. But that was a lot of mods. It wasn't hard to install, but just more so tedious. But I think that's gonna be it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.